Well hi guys, Mark here and today we're going to be looking at the Steelmate smartphone motorcycle tyre pressure monitoring system. Okay then guys, let's take a look at this Steelmate motorcycle tyre pressure monitoring system. Um, so first of all, these come in at the Kony 39.95 um, on the website. Um, they're also suitable for cars, but obviously you need to order two of these. Um, Steelmate do a, a large range of automotive products. Um, they've been around since about 2002. So we'll just take a little look in the box. So first off, you get your quick start guide. So you need to download the app. That's all pretty straightforward. So I haven't actually fitted these yet, so I'll um I will fit them in a minute and then try them out and get back to you. So it's basically just a case of uh, downloading the app, pairing the um sensors and screwing them on. Simple as that. So nice uh, clear looking instructions there. That's all good. So in the little box here, you get your front and rear sensors. I can get them out. So they've got a little barcode on them, which I believe you scan on the app to, um, you know, pair them to your phone. Front and rear. I so say the the batteries are obviously internal, so it's just literally a case of screwing those on. You also get a little um, spanner, and these lock nuts go behind the um, the sensors to obviously lock them in place. So that's in the box. Little spanner, lock nuts, and sensors for your thirty nine ninety five. So um, so basically these are the builders that you can install them in minutes. You download the Steelmate Connect app. As I said, you, you pair them with the app, screw the sensors on with the lock nuts. Um, and then what the good thing with these is it allows you to um, monitor the tire pressures in, in real time. Um, they've got high and low pressure warning. You can adjust the sort of the threshold. So say your tire was say, say your rear tire, you wanted it at 39. You could say set the low at 36 and set the high at about, I don't know, 45, something like that. You know, so you can adjust that in the app. We'll take a look at that later on. Uh, also warns you of air, air leakage and high and low temperature warnings as well. I say it's a wireless Bluetooth transmission. So what I'll do is, I'll go and fit these to the bike now. I'll go out for a ride for a bit, and then I'll um, report back. Okay, guys. So um, I've just uh, fitted the um, tire pressure monitoring system to my bike. Um, screwed it on. Screwed it on with the lock nuts. V very easy to uh, fit. Um, all paired up instantly with the app. You know the sensors kind of uh, wirelessly connected with the app. That was absolutely fine. Um, I took the bike for a quick whiz around the block for a few miles uh, everything seemed absolutely fine so what we do just to show you so this is the app now this is basically what you get and you can name it however you want it so i've called it triumph you basically just tap on that and it brings this page here and you can currently see i hope you can see that uh, front it's showing the battery of the sensor is virtually full and rear it's full and we're currently on 33.6 PSI on the front, which is how I like it to be. And the rear is 39. Now, the interesting thing is my bike is currently, this is this is live now. My bike is about, you know, six, seven meters away downstairs through a wall in the garage. So this is picking up, you know, a good 10 meters away through walls as well. So, you know, you can really monitor it, you know, from your comfort of your bedroom if you wanted to. So um, up here, if you click on the... Uh, settings you've got type tire pressure monitoring system vehicle type obviously bike uh, pressure value you can set all your different um sort of thresholds your low and your high uh, for your front and your rear temperature value you can just set your temperatures as well um, sensor pairing that's obviously to pair it up and then sensor swapping is oh, you can sort of swap front and rear or whatever you want to do so you go back there but i found it to be very easy to set up, um, literally pair the sensors to the app. I use the barcode method, you just scan the barcode. As soon as you screw on the sensors onto the wheels, um, it literally uh, seconds later, it brings up the pressures. So um, that's exactly, and um, it's, it's accurate as well. I've got two other manual um, pressure gauges that I know are pretty much spot on, and I've com compared this with them. So this is reading near as damn it, you know, totally accurate. So uh, 
33 in the front, 39 in the rear. That's how I like it to be. Um, so yeah, it's a really good system, guys. If you want like a DIY uh, tire pressure monitoring system at a good price, I'd give one of these a, a look. It was most importantly, it was very easy to fit and set up, and um, it does exactly what it says on the tin. So um, there you go, guys. All the uh, links are in the description for you, and uh, don't forget to give me a like, share, and subscribe and comment. And I will catch you again in a week or so for another review. Take care guys, ride safe and bye for now.